Our other top story, some newly posted video online showing the chaos that erupted in the halls of Auburn Riverside High School. A mass group of five were let into the school on Monday. Then they ran through the halls, hitting and shoving students. A few days before that, we know that two fights were also reported at the school. As you can imagine, safety was a huge focus at tonight's homecoming game. Good evening, and thank you so much for joining us for Fox 13 News at 11. I'm Matthew Smith. And I'm Nia Wong. Fox 13's Jennifer Dowling was at the school tonight and shows us how parents are reacting to these reports of violence. Many parents tell us that they've seen that violent video and has also heard about the other fights as well. One mom told us that she pulled her son out of school this week as a precaution. In a chaotic and sometimes violent video that many parents and students have now seen, kids can be heard yelling while a group of five are sprinting down the hall, punching at least one student and pushing and slamming into others as they ran. The mass kids running in the school? Oh no, I was not comfortable. Jacqueline Bowl says her son Freddie was in school that day and heard what was happening. So he said all he did was ran out in the hallway and then saw everybody running, but he said one of his classmates got hit. One of his teammates got hit. So, yeah, it's, it's been quite unsettling. He was also sent the video and showed it to his mom. I thought it was bananas. I thought it was crazy. I thought how could this happen? The district says the group was in the building for less than 40 seconds and administrators were chasing them. The school says that two other fights broke out three days earlier and they are trying to figure out if they are related. For tonight's homecoming game, the school said four school resource officers would be at the game along with six school safety officers and administrators. I think because there's no punishment, that's why it keeps happening. I hear my brother talking about it, like telling them. I just, I don't really get why kids would do that. Like, I'm just glad it's not my brother who's doing any of it. As far as keeping her son in school, Bowl says the final straw came Thursday when her son called saying that rumors were spreading that there was going to be a shooting. She pulled him out of school for the day and called administrators. And they did tell me that it was not credible. But in this stage of our lives, we don't know what's credible or not. Bowles feels the principal has been upfront with information and feels reassured that the district is taking things seriously. I do feel safe for tonight. I feel safe for tomorrow for the dance. Um, I'm, I'm good. I'm, I'm really glad they didn't sweep it under the rug. Auburn police tell us they are investigating the incident in the hallway on Monday, and they are also pledging more patrols in and around campus. Reporting from Auburn, Jennifer Dowling, Fox 13 News.